In this question, we have a guy called Vusi who invests an amount of 8,000 Rand for six years. However, in this question, the interest rate changes. So let me show you how to approach this one. So there's a slow way and there's a fast way. I'm going to do both so that you can see what's happening. So for the first two years, the interest rate will be 8%. So let's see how much Vusi will have after those two years. So we know that it's compound interest because um, it says over there compound interest. So we use the compound interest formula where the starting amount is 8,000 Rand. The interest rate is 8%, which is 0 0.08, and that's going to be for two years. And if you go work that out, you get a value of 9,331 Rand and 20 cents. So now that's how much he has after two years. So now you can go use the same formula. Okay, so we use the same formula, but now his starting amount is 9,331 Rand and 20 cents. So we can go 9331.20, where the interest rate is now going to be 9%. So that's 0 0.09, and that's going to be for another two years as well. And so the total is now going to be 11,086 Rand and 40 cents. So now that will become the new amount for year five and year six. So we will use the same formula, where we're starting now with 11,086 Rand and 40 cents. And the interest rate is going to be 10%. So that's going to be 0 0.1. And that's going to be for two years. And if you do that, you'll realize that Vusi is going to have a total amount of 13,414 Rand and 54 cents at the end. Now, try focus as best as you can. Because if you can understand this little trick, it's going to save you a lot of time. That was the slow way. The fast way goes like this. You see this part over here. Well, that gave us 9,331 Rand and 20 cents. What did we do with that amount? Well, we then took that amount and we did this over here. So would you agree that this amount here is the same as all of this, right? So what if we just had to take this bracket over here and place it over there all in one step and then that answer which is this part here what did we do with that well we added this bracket over here so the way the trick works is to just do everything in one step like this so you do the first part like that but instead of calculating this you add on this bracket immediately like this and then instead of calculating that which would have given us that amount you just add on this bracket so you just add all the brackets next to each other and you multiply all of that together like that and it'll give you the same answer of 13,414 Rand and 54 cents so please remember that your teacher will show you in class as well. It's the faster way of doing it. Instead of calculating everything in separate parts, just put all the brackets next to each other.